Hey y'all, it's Matt again from Stay Fit Personal Training, back with another edition of the Stay Fit 5, our weekly series of five videos all dedicated to the same fitness topic. This week's topic has been shin splint prevention as well as calf cramping prevention. This is video number five, which is the seated reverse calf raise exercise. If you have not seen videos one, two, three in the series, you want to watch those videos prior to doing this exercise. In video one, I'll show how to, how to do mild fascia release for the calves. In videos no, number two and three, I show stretches for the tight calf muscles, of course, the muscles on the back side of the lower leg. In this exor exercise today here in video number five, I'm showing you how to strengthen the lengthened and weakened muscles in the front of the lower leg. So to do the seated reverse calf raise, the diet of this is optional. Oftentimes I'll have my clients sit on the diet of this because it helps them to engage their core muscles more, which is an added benefit of the exercise. Um, so to do the seated reverse calf raise, I will have my heels directly under my knees, and then I'll bring my toes up toward my shin, holding for two to three seconds. Three, two, one, one. Three, two, one, two. Uh, eventually, as I as the reps accumulate, I'll feel a burn here around the shins. There's actually muscles here that will align the shin bones, and you'll feel those muscles start to work. So I'll do two sets of 15 reps, and it's very important to hold that top position for two to three seconds and the lower back down slowly. There it is, the seated reverse calf raise exercise. Thank you so much for watching, and have a great day.